Podcast. And I'm John P. On this episode of Geek Beat, Yay! we unbox the new TriCaster Mini. Give that to me. O M G. I've been waiting a long time for this. Actually, you spent 11 hours in the car just to pick up the TriCaster Mini from New Tech HQ. I did. I drove all the way to San Antonio and came back to Dallas. In just, one day, just to In do one this. day, just to get this bad boy. <laughs> I just have one question, John. Yes. Why do you have the Mini and I have the control surface? I thought... I think it's obvious. Be... Because I'm the one who drove 11 hours to get it. <sighs> okay, I'll give you that one. Anyway, the control surface <laughs> the control is awesome. Surface is freaking awesome. Hey, too. I am letting you participate in this. <laughs> and you didn't do the drive, okay? That's so, true, that's true. you know. <laughs> All right, well, Vegas this is. We, we had uh, our hands on with the demo when Philip and Nelson came to town to show it off when they first announced it. When they set up an entire TriCaster Mini in five studio minutes. in five Less Four than. minutes. Yeah. Technically, I think it was like three minutes it was like and three, a, three quarters or something. But he took a little penalty because he didn't turn his cameras on. Right. So we we called it four minutes. It wow. Was pretty impressive. It, very Green impressive. screen, everything. Now the question is, how long will it take us to to set it up for the first? I don't time? know. But, but this, my friends, if you go and buy yourself a TriCaster Mini, this this is what you're going to get. So <laughs> that we have two different boxes here because. The control surface is optional. Now we'll open that next and we'll show you why you might want a control surface, but yes. you don't have to have that. You can operate this thing just with, with just that. a keyboard and mouse, etc. But so let's go ahead and do it. Let's this talk one, about what a TriCaster Mini is. Oh, exactly. By the way, we're using our little quickies. Yes. Our Geek Beat quickies to oh, awesome. uh, open our boxes. <laughs> So TriCaster from New Tech is, they make different sizes, different versions, and they are, the sole purpose is basically a TV studio in a box. That's know. true. By the way, this one that we're gonna unbox right now is a TriCaster Mini HD4i. So that one is HD4i. the bad boy. That's the big one. The, the big this one. thing comes in two variants. Right. Um, one of them is, I think, uh, like $59.99 and the other is like $79.99 and yeah, it's because there. the bigger one has more, yeah. it has two things going on. One, it has more storage capacity Just put it on. and the second thing is it also has a little screen built into the side of it. And I think, and they I think it's they bring, indestructible. It's double boxed. There we go. Oh, there, there we, we go. go. Double boxed for your protection. <laughs> so we have a beautiful white box here and that's it. So. Our quickie will make short work of that. And I know you're so anxious, I aren't know. you? You just can't wait. I just wait. need my hands on it. I need it. Welcome to TriCaster Mini. Your important information is enclosed. So I'm assuming that's gonna be things such as our owner's manual and whatnot, but we're gonna take a look. Normally I would, I would skip right by I would it. skip right over this stuff, but, but not this one. No, you, actually, I don't think you're, you I actually care see. what's over there. I think you're just trying to delay my end, my, uh, maybe, my satisfaction. Maybe, maybe, but I do want to see what we get here. Okay, we've got a welcome uh, guide that's going to show us some stuff. Uh, we have a TriCaster Mini Quick Start Guide. That's the important oh, part for yeah. me. Oh yeah, Quick Start. Also, I they're talking about you guys. can get a virtual set editor. So one of the things that the uh, TriCaster Mini and all the other TriCasters will let you do is shoot against a green screen using virtual sets. Yep. So I guess they're pimping their software. Okay. So this will allow you, the whole thing will allow you to, to set up multiple cameras, switch between those cameras, do green screen effects if you want. You can add titles, lower thirds, like somebody's name and website address. You can add video and pictures into the story that you're creating on video. All sorts of stuff. What you got over there, John? I can't see. I have the new tech keyboard. I'm just uh, checking to see if there's anything special with this particular keyboard, other than the fact that it's black and it has a new tech logo on it and stuff like that. I think uh, those are primarily I think it's backlit. Simple. I think okay. it's backlit because it says LED illumination, so that's good. So you can backlight it. That's good because it's a traditional keyboard. Yeah, in a dark in a dark room. No, okay. We need that. Now let's see what else we've got here. We're just gonna pull this yeah. piece right here. Some power. We have a power cable and a power brick. brick. It's a pretty good size power brick. What do you got there? A mouse? Mouse. We got a mouse, a nice little new tech 
mouse, now but I, I assume you could use any other mouse. Now for the and gem. There we go. That's it, the TriCaster Mini. It's so super simple. That's all that comes in the box. Huh. You've got the mini, the mouse, the keyboard, and a power brick. And the quick start guide. Don't forget the quick oh, start guide. Oh, and the quick guide. start guide. <laughs> and here it is. And you remember, you remember what I was telling you about the mini having uh, this particular version of the Mini having a screen on it. So this one has a screen right here. Can be used for any any kind of content you want to put on it. Traditionally, I think the way we would use it is we would have a monitor that we're using for switching, but right. you might have this sitting here and that's the feed that's going out. You know at all times so that's, what people are seeing and that's important in a live production. Yeah. Uh, and also, um, it's it's lightweight, but it's not too lightweight that it's just gonna fall over. Yeah. So it's like kind of the perfect. Let's take a look at what we've got here for inputs, outputs, etc. We've got a DVI video one port. We've got an HDMI video two port. We've got four USB three ports, Ethernet. Here's another HDMI, a Display Port, another DVI. That is a lot of video ports. There's like one, two, three, five video ports, four USB ports, two USB 2.0 ports, keyboard, and all kinds of audio on the back here. And on the other side. Yep, and on the other side, we've got four HDMI input ports, and we've got two video output ports. Nice. And then we've got microphones and headphones in and out. So that is a, an awful lot. It in is. one tiny little box to be able to handle that many audio and video sources, it's just crazy. And we could take it on the plane, which is awesome. Yeah, so let's take a look at the at the, uh, the control, control surface. Now what this is, is it's kind of like a keyboard, but it's a specialized keyboard so that you can switch cameras. Uh, without having to without memorize having, key. Yeah. Uh, key combinations on the keyboard and stuff and it's dual boxed for your safety and pleasure <laughs> and to just drive when, Callie Lewis nuts. So let's try it this way. When you're not doing this on camera it works better. Here we go. <laughs> hey don't touch my surface. Okay I'm not I'm just turning wow, it over for I you. I can't believe that was just a little ploy wasn't uh -huh. it? There we go. All right let's All right. take a look at it. Dear TriCaster Mini CES owner, control surface owner. So a little uh, little information sheet here. We get a USB uh, cable, just the 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 square kind of adapter there that you use the for for keyboardy type devices. Okay, and go ahead and pull that off. Oh. Hold that. There we go. Pull that off. And uh, here we go. I love these control surfaces. They're really cool looking, especially when they're all lit up. Yeah. The big one that we have in the studio is insane. This is pretty much all you need to take on the go. So uh, you've got uh, your like kind of overlay stuff over here, your program, your preview. So this is what's live. So you can say, I want camera, camera one four. to be live and then I'm gonna set up camera number two to go next, but that's not live until I hit two over here. Stuff like that. Uh, you've got background uh, images and all sorts of stuff over here. This fancy little slider. I like that the slider. For, I love sliders. That's for doing transitions. So let's say you're on camera number one and you wanna like smoothly transition yeah. to camera number like two. fade in or you'd, whatever. You'd push uh, program number one, so you're on camera one, and then you hit preview number two. So camera number two is waiting in the wings and then you just slide, slide that to transition from one to the other if you don't want a quick cut i'm just gonna start sliding so, everywhere are you nice okay well <laughs> we're we're gonna slide on out of here pretty soon um it's it's interesting that all you have to do to hook that up is plug that Let's in that plug the keyboard plug the mouse we're done so what we're gonna do next is we're gonna show you guys an optimal traveling rig the complete yeah. setup with this thing we're gonna have the cameras We've got very special monitors you don't even know about yet. I don't. I don't know about this. I what, spent, what's going? On? What? Did, did, how much did you spend? I spent a little bit on these new monitors. Jumpy. But you guys are gonna love them to go with this because they're super portable. So they should be here tomorrow. After they get here, we're gonna set those up okay. with the cameras. Yep. And not only that, we're going to build an entire case. Like we're going to fit it all 
in a in, travel suitcase that we could take on the that's plane. That's right. With us. And we're going to show you guys how it all goes together, how to take it yeah. out, set it up, the whole nine yards. So stay tuned for that because it's coming soon. I'm so excited. Thanks to New Tech uh, for letting John drive down there yesterday and interrupt everything. <laughs> yeah, it was great. And if you guys have any questions about how this all works, mm -hmm. leave comments below. We will be doing more videos about it and showing you how, like John said. So we'll keep uh, keep a look on the. We'll questions. answer all the questions. We'll keep a look on it. That's, all right, guys. That's correct grammar. Thumbs up for the TriCaster Mini. <laughs> Two if you got them. We'll see you later. Bye.